y'all i'm here today to finally share the bun tutorial that i've been promising y'all forever and if y'all follow me on my blog or my instagram you see that i absolutely love wearing this bun i wear it multiple times a week it's so easy it's best for dirty hair too i like to say like day two or day three hair or beyond <laughs> is when the bun looks its best so tutorial is a hairband it doesn't really even matter what color it is because you're not going to be able to see it and this is like my secret weapon you don't have to have this but it makes it a lot easier to get volume and pull the hair pieces out so your hair isn't flat on your head so basically you're just going to gather all of your hair into a high ponytail if your hair is dirty like mine is i already went ahead and put my favorite dry shampoo in so it's really important just to have everything nice and smooth you can go over and smooth like little tiny bumps with the comb well i'll try to do it slow so walk you through. So you do it once, twice, and then do not pull it through on the second time. You can see where I am. I'm about halfway down my ponytail. I'm going to take my fingers, grab the bottom, twist it like so. So my band, y'all can see where my band is, and pull it over my bun. So basically I have two buns, and a tail. I'll do that again. I'm gonna do it one more time so y'all can get down the technique. And that's all for the bun. So it's, it's really important to master this part because the rest of it is just you kind of pulling it apart to get it how you want to look. like to pull the back part of the bun first to make it fuller and give it volume and then you still have your front little bun and I like to leave my tail in the back you can always just like pin it under now you just kind of take and pull that little top bun if there are any pieces you don't like the way that they're looking you can always pin them down like I don't like the way that looks right there so I can just take my bobby pin and pin it there you go. Now comes the fun part. I like to kind of smooth everything over with the comb first just to make sure there are no little like bumpies. And I just start pulling the hair out from the front. You can see I'm not pulling back here. I'm pulling right here so really close to the front of my head. And that'll help give lift without undoing the bun. You can also use your fingers too if you don't have one of these combs. I kind of like to go in and just pull little pieces at the end with my fingers anyways. What it looks like from the back, so you have this little piece of hair. So I like to just kind of tuck it up and just pin it so there's not like a tail hanging down like that. There's like no wrong way to do it. Um, and easy, easy does it with the pulling. You can't put the hair back in your bun if you pull too much out. So just go slow and steady and just kind of like even right now there's a few more pieces that like i could pull on lift in the front don't know i like big hair so and that's what it looks like up close it's really easy once you get down the technique please let me know if y'all try this look tag me in your photos send me pictures on instagram definitely don't think that it goes unnoticed it totally makes my day when y'all send me that kind of stuff so thanks again and i'll talk to y'all soon bye Thank you.